హలో ఫ్రెండ్స్ ఫస్ట్ ఆఫ్ ఆల్ లెట్ మీ ఎక్స్ప్రెస్ మై సిన్సియర్ అపాలజీస్ ఫర్ నాట్ అప్డేటింగ్ ఫర్ ది పాస్ట్ ఫ్యూ వీక్స్ సమ్ పర్సనల్ ఇష్యూస్ హెల్త్ ఇష్యూస్ ఫోర్స్ మీ అండ్ ఫోర్స్ మీ ఫర్ దట్ అండ్ ఐ కుడ్ నాట్ పోస్ట్ వీడియోస్ ఎనీ హౌ వీ ఆర్ బ్యాక్ అగెయిన్ సి అట్ ప్రెసెంట్ నిఫ్టీ ఈస్ ట్రేడింగ్ అరౌండ్ లెవెన్ థౌజండ్ సెవెన్ హండ్రెడ్ లెవెల్స్ రఫ్లీ అండ్ ఇఫ్ యూ అబ్జర్వ్ హౌ నిఫ్టీ సడన్లీ షార్ట్ అప్ టు సెవెన్ థౌజండ్ సెవెన్ హండ్రెడ్ లెవెల్స్ వీ సీ దట్ ద మెయిన్ కాంట్రిబ్యూషన్ కేమ్ ఫ్రమ్ బ్యాంక్స్ అండ్ ఫినాన్షియల్స్ వన్స్ నిఫ్టీ క్రాస్ లెవెన్ థౌజండ్ త్రీ సిక్స్టీ లెవెల్స్ even 11500 didn't appear to be a very big resistance for nifty in fact in that expiry huge calls were written around 11500 but anyhow nifty managed to close above 11500 and in one of my uh, what to say now one of my group whatsapp group i posted that nifty is now comfortably capable of scaling 11660 and it happened on friday there are many reasons which can be attributed for this the sudden appreciation of rupee the op- operation twist conducted by rbi the fed's approach in approach in handling what inflation all those things propelled nifty to a level which was not imagined even by what an ordinary or even an ordinary or so i cannot say that it's an ordinary even people who are regular traders as i told this movement was highly possible because of the shocking movement in what in bankings and financial stocks suddenly the sentiment changed in banking stocks and imagine how ICICI bank climbed from 14360 levels to 410 state bank of india from 190 to 220 axis bank from 440 to 500 many other banks so all banking stocks suddenly what started to move like anything this is very big now what will happen next see actually saying i too was of the opinion that there was a possibility for nifty to correct from 11400 to 11200 levels i expected a 200 point correction because i was tentative on this agr judgment and all those things were there and that may have a negative impact of markets and markets were also on what on an overbought stage i had a personal opinion on that and we to bought puts but unfortunately what happened for us not for others unfortunately for us market started to climb like anything and there's no stopping it's marching like anything fii's are regularly buying to the tune of 1000 crores daily many stocks have broken out that is they have given a clear breakout from their range so nifty as of now is comfortably poised from 10600 la 66680 levels if nifty crosses 720 that is 11007% from 11660 levels if nifty crosses 11720 it can easily move up to 11880 levels so i probably expect that this may happen again in this week itself because still the big boy of market reliance is not performing now suddenly there is a good news in the form of what reliance taking over future retail and who knows what may happen in the agr judgment reliance if it starts to perform then nifty will easily scale another 100 points so the present moment there is no need to panic at all because several factors are contributing to what towards the march of nifty in the northward direction this unlock four guidelines is again a positive so virtually everything is now opened up bearing movies schools 
and colleges virtually everything is of almost open to the fullest level so that itself is a very big positive for markets so you can easily imagine nifty to scale new highs that means 880 950 then 12000 okay so nifty is just shy of another say 700 points of touching that all time high of 12400 globally markets especially us markets are so strong so snp is making regular highs on a daily basis so there is no need to worry at all and uh, this market will give you money provided if you are patient and if you believe in the story of india so i personally feel that markets are having enough firepower to take the nifty back to 12400 levels at the earliest but it will not happen in the near uh, one or two months but it is on the verge of going to what is moving in that direction mini stocks are what to say on the verge of breakout and if that breakout happens 10% 15% move can be easily easily seen in stocks like bpcl stocks like uh, shriram transport finance you can check that stocks like mcdowells all those things are comfortably poised for a clear breakout already many stocks have broken out and the only thing is even uh, united phosphorus limited upl has given a clear breakout you can check all those stocks and whenever it falls it is the right time to buy and accumulate penny stocks are moving like anything put some money in penny stocks some good penny stocks that is stocks which are valued which are uh, costing less than 20 rupees put your money invest 500 or 1000 shares forget about that for 6 months or 1 year then you will get minimum 20 to 30 percent reserves that is assured one till 40 50 days back we gave a call on dish tv at around 8 rupees 25 paise now it's trading around 11 rupees 70 paise that is nearly 40 percent up move so this markets will reward people who are who have patience who can wait and who can put the money with what with guts so thank you so much sorry for not updating uh, for the past few weeks from here onwards we will be updating we will also be giving you some inputs regarding what regarding some particular sectors okay thank you for watching as usual please like comment share and support us thank you